First up, we have a high-speed chase unlike any other. In New Mexico, police on horseback were seen galloping after a shoplifter. That's right, folks, it was a literal Wild West pursuit in the 21st century. Next, we head over to Detroit, where children scrambled to collect marshmallows dropped from a helicopter. Talk about sweet rain. Moving on, Easter in Norway turned into an extravaganza, as Norwegians hoarded eggs from Sweden due to a shortage. Guess they really wanted to make sure they had their Easter omelets. In the UK, a comedian found his hot dog too hot to handle when it was removed from a subway poster over a junk food ban. Talk about a bun of contention. And in Arizona, a stinky situation arose as a noxious weed forced a National Monuments picnic area to close. Visitors were left holding their noses instead of their picnic baskets. Over in California, a police department's creative use of Lego heads to cover suspects' faces sparked a debate on policing and privacy. Seems like they took building a case a bit too literally. In New Jersey, firefighters rescued a yellow Labrador stuck in a spare tire. The dog's name Daisy, and she's now rolling around safe and sound. Maple syrup in New Jersey? You bet, the state is tapping into the syrup market, proving they're more than just turnpikes and tolls. Paris celebrated its waiters and waitresses with a race through the city center. Balancing a croissant and cup of water on a tray, they dashed to the finish line, showcasing their skills beyond the cafe tables. And finally, a Swedish landowner can now claim I've got space rocks. After a court ruled that a meteorite belongs to the owner of the property where it landed. That's one giant leap for property rights. That's all for this week's The Quirky Corner. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more wacky stories. Until next time, keep laughing at the lighter side of life.